Hello, 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 ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Garak here, your casual gamer dad, coming at you guys with another episode of Garak Talks, uh, our monthly check in where I go ahead and discuss everything life, love, and gaming, how it all relates to the channel, and uh, what it means for you guys, my viewers. So, uh, <laughs> man, I have a lot of updates coming at you guys this time around uh they're gonna be some pretty big doozies uh, i do have to apologize uh if i seem a little grumpy grumpy uh my stress levels are absolutely through the roof at the moment um content has been lacking aside from the halloween horror event i know and i apologize but unfortunately due to the first two updates that are coming at you guys in like a minute or two it's gonna get more sparse I do apologize, but it's going to happen. You'll understand why when I say so. Um, contrary to that, though, uh, the, obviously at the end of October, right before Halloween, uh, my beautiful better half and I went on one last trip, one last hurrah, a sort of a baby moon as we dubbed it. Uh, we went to Hawking Hills in Ohio uh, to a place called Ravenwood Castle. Excellent place super fantastic the 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 person who owns it is a giant D, &D nerd so there's all kinds of like pathfinder and D, &D stuff there and tons tons of board games and just tabletop games and card games and tons of it just everywhere it is wicked it is wicked fun but more on that point is we went during the halloween weekend event where the mad professor uh von gerd as he's known uh was there running a ton of different gaming events and it was fun as balls it was it's the second time we've been there during a giant game event and it's some of the most fun that we've had ever ever so big big shout out to the mad professor uh you can actually follow him on youtube if you look up uh him by his out of character name alan gurdon girding g-e-r-d-i-n-g i'll put a link in the description down below to his channel uh, i definitely suggest you follow him he's got some really good stuff out there and it's not just all about gaming but the ones he puts up about like all the different games that he he designs and hosts is just like phenomenal he's just a wicked awesome person so shout out to him and definitely follow his youtube channel because he's awesome and he deserves it now under the updates for us so as you all know we are on the eve of baby our second is due to arrive originally it was supposed to be november 14th unfortunately ladies and gentlemen that is not going to happen this is going to happen much 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 earlier much earlier now i know i do try to post these kind of updates on the first of november whether or not everybody watches it on the first of november i'm not sure um but unfortunately well not really unfortunately timing wise she has been moved ahead by quite a few days so our newest addition to our family is actually due to arrive now on wednesday the 2nd of november <laughs> due to some health issues nothing crazy serious but just something that the doctors were not comfortable letting sit there and lie uh, with baby due to arrive they said we're bumping your your appointment up by a couple weeks we're serving that child an eviction notice she's coming out we're putting it in on november 2nd so by the time you guys watch this our newborn may already actually be here and for those of you who are like me you are gamer parents moms or dads um you will know that when there's a newborn in the house there is very little time for anything very little time for relaxing very little time for gaming very little time for sleep there's gonna be no time for sleep this is gonna be constant go 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 so there's a lot that needs to happen i need to see if i can push up my parental leave by like a week or two at work if i can do that or if i just have to burn up whatever time i have left which i don't think is much uh first and then parental leave kicks in i don't know um we don't like we're we're just not we're I, I, I she's ready my beautiful better half she is she is ready she's ready i am not ready i'm not ready <laughs> i've had nine months to get ready for this and i'm still not freaking ready i'm like oh no 
this is it's it's too soon so nevertheless uh content from me may be getting sparse uh due to the arrival of the new member of our family um understandably so i will try i mean as you all know i make it a point to do all of my gaming late at night after everyone has gone to bed but as you also know infants don't necessarily sleep they don't have a schedule it's kind of just like sleep wake up cry eat sleep rinse repeat and every few hours you know every hour or two you're if the baby itself doesn't wake up to eat you know, wake the baby up to let it eat because they got to get the nutrition in their body so nevertheless um depending on how well uh our new little one takes to a bottle because our first did not like a bottle period um will depend on how many feedings i can assist with and obviously i will be there to do everything i can so even though i do my gaming late at night that doesn't necessarily mean i'm out of the woods i will be doing as much assisting as i can as a good husband and father does um and that means i may have less content for you all to see and i apologize for that but don't worry it will start coming as routines begin forming as sleep patterns begin developing you'll when you start seeing more videos from me you'll know oh okay things are getting back to normal here um videos are a little bit easier because i can cut and edit if i need to streams are not streams are going to be very difficult i do apologize that you guys have not had a stream in like definitely over a week probably going on to uh and you're probably not going to get one for a while sorry um because all of this ties into the second giant announcement and assuming knock on wood nothing happens uh we're going to be moving at roughly the same time not not exactly the same time actually uh so we have been house hunting for a while um as many of you know we have been shacking up with my mother-in-law uh since covid hit and we relocated from massachusetts to ohio uh we've been shacking up here you know as a way to like uh, excuse me uh to save money and just you know get acclimated with the ohio area and just get ourselves settled in new careers and then once we were ready we were gonna we were gonna get out of here well obviously things got pushed around a little bit but here we are We've been house hunting for a while. We finally found one that checks almost all of our boxes. It checks all of her boxes. And it checked all but one of mine. Mine, My only box that didn't get checked was having a, my own little, like, office space area that I could, like, soundproof and just turn into, like, a, you know, kind of like a gamer cave slash office. Uh, I'm not going to have that. There's just no room to accommodate that in the new house. But... It checked all the other boxes the price was right we slapped an offer down and they accepted it so we are currently going through the process of attempting to close on this house um this being our first time ever doing it it's been confusing and a little bit frustrating just because we keep getting bombarded with requests for paperwork we have already turned in i don't know how the process goes so we're like constantly in contact with these people but we are set to close on the 10th of november so the day before veterans day we are due to close and get those damn keys and uh, i promise you guys as soon as i get the keys to the house i will give you all the grand tour so you guys get to put up with my really bad phone camera skills but i'll record a video slap it on the channel um but when you combine newborn with house that we will have to relocate and move into and you know we have to wait until all the utilities are set up the the internet the electric you know the electricity water everything's in our name it's gonna be a lot so i am definitely gonna be mia we're gonna say minimum of one month expect me to be missing any action so don't expect much from me until somewhere around middle to the end of december maybe um, but I will do my best to try to post something up. Uh, it seems that I have unlocked the ability to make posts on my YouTube channel now. So I'll at least be able to throw the post out here and there and just keep you guys updated on what's going on. So look out for those. 
that's really all I've got for real life updates, man. <laughs> but they're huge. Those are two big ones. And that, I mean, those have already taken up pretty much the entire time. So quick, quick rundown on gaming updates. I don't really have much. Uh, Halloween Horror Extravaganza of 2022 has finished and I believe was a great success. Uh, I still haven't gotten my last subscriber to hit my 10 subscriber goal before the end of 2022 yet. But I did get a lot of views on a lot of those uh, streams and slash or videos. So it's a plus. Uh, keep it up, guys. I appreciate it. I really do. Um, so with the end of Halloween Horror, we, you know, if I have any time to try to squeeze anything in, I will be attempting to get things back on track, primarily with Skyrim. Um, finishing my Final Fantasy XIV review series. I have a few more PvP reviews to do, as well as I gotta finish leveling Black Mage eventually and give you guys the PvE and PvP review for that. Um, speaking of Final Fantasy, business as usual. Cap and Tombstones, running roulettes, getting jobs I want to get get to level 90 to level 90. You know, the whole thing. Nothing really too fantastic relic quests have been released finally so i'll keep you guys you know in the loop about what's going on with all that um other games seven days to die if i have any time at all to squeeze a stream in here and there i will be picking up friday nights uh darkness falls fridays as well as some of the other vanilla challenges i was doing such as glock nine's rambler man challenge um, I will try to do those as best I can. I cannot promise you guys anything, but I will do everything I can to do so. Um, the only other thing really on the map for me at the moment is Valheim. Diving back into Valheim, and the reason for this is because they have announced uh, Miss Lands is coming. So there's going to be a huge update sometime. We don't exactly know when hopefully it's soon and uh i never even got to check out the whole like mountain frost clan update yet i just never dove back into it so i think maybe you know if i can find some time to do anything i might dive back into some uh valheim we will see i'll keep you guys posted on all that stuff though but uh, i'm gonna tie this video up here because it's gonna run long if i keep rambling on i don't have much else to update for you guys anyway because i don't really know what to expect for this month with baby and house at the same time so wish me luck guys because i'm gonna need it um hope that i can just grit my teeth and keep keep the stress down as best i can i will do everything i can to make sure that happens and um i will check in with you guys as best i can and i'll keep you guys posted on what's going on so once again uh shout out to alan girding for the amazing halloween weekend event over at Ravenwood Castle. Uh, I will put a link to his channel in the description below, so check him out. He's got some good stuff, and he's just a really awesome guy. Um, baby in house at the same time in November. Expect me to be missing in action for about a month. Not really much else to update as far as gaming goes beyond that. So thank you so much for watching, guys. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. Uh, if you want to see more from me, if you want to follow some of my series on the channel, you know, kind of take the time that I'm going to be missing in action to catch up on some Skyrim or whatever, feel free to hit that subscribe button, please. It'll help my channel grow. It will help me reach that goal that I have to hit 10 subscribers before the end of 2022. We are one away from the hitting that. And uh, it just keeps me motivated to keep making stuff for you guys. Um, I mean, I do it anyway because I think it's fun. But, you know, motivation's always nice. Uh, so, yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. Uh, I'm going to sign out now, and y'all have a good one. I'll see you in the next one.